Hi J-Bays, it's Victoria James and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and click that red subscriber button, become a J-Bay and join the J-Bay fam where we chit chat and all that about luxury beauty. I just got home from a very nice weekend with my mom and my daughter and I just wanted to show you what uh, I picked up for luxury beauty over the weekend from Selfridges and Sephora. So let's get started friends. First up, are the new lipsticks from Merit. I picked up two of them. We have the official name as the, where is it? Oh, goodness, what's the name? The Signature Lip Lightweight Matte Lipsticks. So I have the Signature Satins and uh, those are gorgeous. I use them all the time. My favorite shade is 1980. It's practically like perfect for my lips. And so these two shades I picked up, I picked up a red and a neutral. This is how the component looks. It stores your lipstick upside down to keep the moisture where it needs to be at the very top. <laughs> um, this one is, um, I thought about a contour shade, but these are the um, my complexion shade and my highlight shade. I chose Palm, which is 33N. And um, the official name of these is the Skin Rewind Complexion Stick, Weightless Firming Smoothing Ceramide Peptide Complex plus Butterfly Lavender and Kelp Extract Honey. I'm going to turn on my computer and get in here and look at my order form to see if I actually did include all three. And, and if I did, oh, that's cute. It has, um, I don't know if you guys can see that. It has Ilya spelled out on the top of the cap as well as written out on the side. It's like engraved on the top. Very cute. Is this like an ergonomic, is this on purpose? hold on let me look at the other one because if that's bent uh, y'all gonna take that back honey but if that's it, like intentional that's actually kind of genius yes it is <laughs> i love that do you see that there's an indent to hold it properly with your thumb that is so cool oh i love it and then there's an indent here for when you're going to open it Ilya, this is so cool that is so fun. And Ilya is also engraved on the um, product. This is so cool. This color is absolute perfection. So yeah, like you got a good grip on it when you're twisting it up. This is too good. Oh yeah, baby. Look at that color. This is so great. Ilya, y'all did your big one. This is good. This is good. If this performs as well as it looks here, whoo, I am excited. Shut the front and back door. This is so good. Um, and then this is 28N Moria, which I would use for a brightening. Beautiful. Oh, these colors are good. Have you seen the um, promotions for these? These colors are good. Y'all were in the lab, honey. Oh, we. Let's look at this one. This is the Groundworks Blooming Romance Palette from Danessa Myricks. I had to get my hands on this as soon as I saw it, you guys. As soon as I saw it, I said, I gotta have it. Like, no questions asked. Didn't even need to see it demonstrated. Like, I just knew. I knew I was picking this up. I popped my nail off. Lord have mercy. Anyway, we're just gonna move forward. I am in love. Let me go ahead and peel this off. This is so me. And I was not all that interested in the first one. I was like, eh, it's all right. But I also picked up, uh, at the time, I picked up the Pat, Mag Pat McGrath, the Patrick Ta All Matte Nudes uh, Eyeshadow Palette, which I love. So I didn't want to pick this up too, or the first groundwork as well, because it just seemed like the same thing, uh, even though hers is more multi-purpose. So yeah, these are pans that you can take out See, they have that little groove right there to depot. And this color story is absolutely phenomenal. Like you've got something for a lot of different purposes for your face. Of course, there's a cream and a powder equivalent for each color. So you can put them on your lips, you can put them on your cheeks, you can put them on your eyes. So I don't know if there's colors that are not intended for eyes that might, they might mention that on the back here. I am very, very excited. I can't wait to do a video for, to sh demonstrate this for you guys. Just, oh, so incredibly beautiful. Very excited to try this out. Now for Selfridges. So I feel like I definitely did a good job picking things out. I did get another Prada 
foundation. This time I got um, Prada's uh, DW80, the shade DW80, because the as I was looking at all of the models that they were using, for examples, she looked the most like me. And so I felt like I needed just a little warmth. Oh yeah, we hit the jackpot, Buki. Yeah. Ew. This is going to be good. It looks just like the Christian Louboutin. So I think we did really well. Yay, finally. I <laughs> didn't have to keep doing it. <laughs> but yeah, so we've seen my review of this product. So we know how the formula works. We're just going to do a short to show you the color that works, just like we did for Christian Louboutin. I picked up the Sisley um, Fito Top Perfection Luminous Matte Ultra Long Lasting Skincare Foundation in 6N. I'm normally 6C Amber, but this is a new shade called Sandalwood. I think we nailed it again. Ah! Okay, so I'm very excited about this. Can't wait to review this for you guys. Um, Fun fact, if you get this off of Selfridges, it's 88 bucks. Um, they do have a $30 shipping, so I think it actually balances out. Um, but if you already have the international shipping, you do save. So um, yeah, just thought I'd throw that out there. I can't wait to put this on my face. It looks so good. <laughs> the other thing I picked up that I had been meaning to replace the color of is the Hermes Plain Air Skin Tint. This has such great coverage for a skin tint, and this color is the perfect match for me. Last time I got like 90 or something, it was freaking way too dark for me. Um, so this time I picked up 80 Barrenia. I almost bought Tamarind, which was 85. Wouldn't have made sense. I think I'm really glad I went with this one uh, because this color is literally matching everything that's sitting here. So super excited. And then the last one, the last one is the, I'm, I'm most excited about this. The Gucci Cushion Foundation. God, I hope I got the right shade, y'all. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, would you get into this packaging? Oh my God, it's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. So let's have a look at the color because that's the one thing I'm like most concerned about. You get a nice mirror. You get a nice little, the typical cushion for a cushion foundation. That's the typical way it looks and then you open it to the side like this. And you peel off, hopefully this is easy, you peel this off to reveal the shade. I mean, that looks good. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. I think I did it. I think I did it justice, you guys. I think I nailed it. <laughs> I'm super stoked. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'll be dedicated videos to these two. Okay, dedicated videos to these two. This one I have already done a video for. So again, I'll do a short to show you the correct shade, just like I did for Christian Louboutin Beauty. So it's going to be the Prada one and that one, shorts. The Sicily and the Gucci dedicated videos, as well as the Ilian. I, the reason I bought three shades is to give you a full face. So I'm so stoked. I don't even know what to do with myself. Hope you enjoyed this video. Really quick kind of luxury beauty haul. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Move me up in the algorithm so the girls can see me too. Don't forget to subscribe. Join the J Bay family's chit chat and all that about luxury beauty. I've got um, a Target haul coming up. So we're gonna do a little fashion as well. <laughs> Thank you so much for checking me out today. Um, hope you stick around. Love to have you here. All right, I'm going to get out of here. The sun is moving in, as you can see. So I'm going to finish unpacking from my trip. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend. Mwah. Bye.